please excuse any mispronunciations that I use. I'm not real good at names, but I'm going to do my best. I mean no disrespect. This story is about Dwight Stallings, who vanished from Elk Grove, California, sometime after April 1st, 2011. He was just shy of his first birthday at the time and should be 12 years old now. Dwight's parents, Hasuan Stallings and Tanisha Edwards, were still speaking on the phone at the time. He was in jail and she was in and out of jail around the time that Dwight disappeared. Tanisha was has two older children that CPS took from her prior to Dwight, to Dwight being born. Her mom has custody of them. Tanisha used drugs while pregnant with Dwight and was ordered to do drug testing after he was born, which she often failed. The last time relatives seen Dwight was in April 2011. From April 2011 to July 2012, CPS made many attempts to locate Dwight, but Tanisha refused to say where he was. Anytime his father asked about him, Tanisha made excuses about him being somewhere else. She made claims that Dwight was with an unidentified relative, had been abducted by two men dressed in black clothing, or had died of natural causes at an unidentified hospital. In August of 2011, she told someone at a bar that Dwight had been dead for six weeks. Then, by the end of the year, she admitted to her mom that she didn't know where he was, and then she refused to talk about him anymore. And she even forbade her other children from talking about him. Eventually, Tanisha claimed she gave Dwight to two women in Reno, Nevada to hide him from CPS. She claims the women would call sometimes to tell her how Dwight was doing, but the calls ended in December 2011. Hasuan doesn't believe her story. In January 2015, Tanisha was convicted of perjury for lying about where her son was. I would like to believe that someone has been raising Dwight for the past 11 years, no matter how he came into their custody, and I hope someday he will be found safe. If anybody has any possible leads in this case, please check out the contact information in the description. Thank you.